can you kill a virus with Glen 20? Well, I had a look on the side of the bottle of Glen 20 uh, and it does say 60% alcohol. So providing you've got a thick enough coating and the alcohol gets to kiss up against the virus and then disrupt that fatty coating, sure, it will kill or disrupt the virus. If you do nothing, the infection rate just goes up like this and the death rate just goes up and then will come down. And what we're trying to do is this. Why? Because this, if we have this, then it turns out that here is what the hospital system can handle. And if all these people here, we can't handle them. So what we're trying to do is do the quarantine and social isolation thing so that we have a smaller number of people in the system at any given time. Still, everybody gets infected, half the people get infected, but at a slower rate, and that everybody who needs hospital treatment can get it and live. Basically, it means that if most of the population is resistant to whatever disease is coming through, then the few people who aren't resistant, they'll be safe. So suppose you've got 100 people and you have something like whooping cough and it lands on somebody, well, the chances are 99 to 1 that it'll land on somebody who's resistant to it and so it might jump to another person who's probably resistant and then it'll die. Not sure, we're thinking maybe three hours on copper up to a couple of days on stainless steel. Either way, metho or Glen 20 or anything with 60% alcohol will work. There is a strange thing that infectious diseases tend to be more common in winter and even today in 2020, we're not 100% sure. We think that in general, that the higher temperatures are a little bit hostile to the virus, that is such a wussy phrase, I'm kind of ashamed for saying it, and that lower temperatures are more conducive, I'm ashamed for saying that too. We're not entirely sure, but we do know for sure that with many infectious diseases, they're worse in winter. Just try and keep your distance. On average, you're going to get infected. And on average, you'll come out okay. But we want to reduce the number of people who get infected at any given time. We want to have the curve flattening out. So just try to isolate yourself, um, then use the internet and the phone network to communicate with people. Strange world. Things are going to be very different for the next year. Just go with the flow, man, you'll be cool.